benzodiazepine overdose is the topic and um, benzodiazepine overdose um, basically what I want to cover in this video is two scenarios the first is uh, benzodiazepines uh, that people take to help with um, anxiety what happens if they overdose how do you reverse it and the second uh, scenario is basically when someone has an adverse reaction to benzodiazepines during anesthesia and uh, what happens there. So um, I just wanted to quickly list uh, some uh, benzodiazepines uh, so you have an idea of what I'm talking about. So for the regular benzodiazepines that people take for anxiety, you have alprazolam, which is very common. Uh, there's also diazepam. And there's another one that's very common called lorazepam. And then the ones uh, that are used for anesthesia, there's quite a few. But there's a very common local one uh, that's given IV. It's called midazolam. I wanted to talk about a very specific uh, medication that helps reverse uh, the benzodiazepine um, uh, overdose. And that medication is called flumazenil. And this, this is what I want to talk about. Flumazenil, essentially, is a benzodiazepine receptor antagonist. And I wanted to um, illustrate what that actually means with a little diagram. So let's say you have a, a benzodiazepine receptor uh, area. So this is a benzo receptor. And normally benzodiazepine um, uh, agonists or benzodiazepine receptor agonists that uh, work to sti stimulate this uh, receptor will fit perfectly in here. So let's draw a little diagram. Uh, the, it'll be something like that. So it fits perfectly if it goes in. It's just like a puzzle. And uh, let's say this one is um, a medication, alprazolam. Now, these are agonists, right? But we have a benzodiazepine receptor antagonist called flumazenil. And what that um, shape is, is something like this. It's shaped sort of like that. So as you can see, if that were to come and sit here, it would actually block, it would block the receptor site so it's given a certain name, it's called competitive, competitively inhibits the activity at the benzodiazepine uh, recognition site on this uh, receptor uh, complex area. And I just wanted to quickly mention that, illustrate that. So you've got uh, symptoms, a scenario, you've got two scenarios that I wanted to talk about right the first is just the basic benzo overdose that someone's taking for anxiety and the second scenario is when they have an adverse reaction to benzodiazepine anesthesia so the first scenario the symptoms are very heavy sedation so the patient is very heavily sedated they took too much of some benzodiazepine they can also have slurred speech and they may also have a very decreased respiratory rate a normal respiratory rate you know, between 12 and 20 they might be down to 8 breaths per minute now somebody has an adverse reaction the second scenario to anesthesia they're given a benzodiazepine maybe an IV midazolam uh, locally and they have an adverse reaction how would they present um, they would have uh, interestingly some agitation they would uh, be combat combative and the person may also have some involuntary movements. So obviously both of these scenarios are unwanted scenarios, unwanted uh, effects, so you want to reverse this. And the good news is that both of these scenarios can be reversed by the same drug, and that's the drug that we're talking about, flumazenil. And it's usually given as a dose, uh, 0 0.2 milligrams IV over 30 seconds. So. You've got benzodiazepines, I listed some of them. Um, I told you that uh, flumazenil is a benzodiazepine receptor antagonist. It competes with the benzodiazepines, and it's an, this can be used as an antidote 
to reverse benzodiazepine overdose and also to help reverse anesthesia, unwanted side effects uh, if uh, they occur. So let's take a look at some clinical vignettes, see what this looks like in a patient presentation. A 46-year-old woman visits her podiatrist to have several bunions removed from her right foot. She chooses conscious sedation rather than general anesthesia uh, for the procedure. She is given IV midazolam to supplement the local anesthetics that are injected into her foot. Midway through the surgery, she suddenly becomes agitated, combative, and exhibits involuntary movements. The anesthesiologist determines that she is having a paradoxical reaction to the midazolam and immediately administers. All right, well, you obviously want to reverse this, so what do you use? Well, let's go through these. Let's go through these in reverse order. Protamine. Protamine is used for heparin overdose. Heparin OD. Nitrite is used uh, as an antidote for cyanide poisoning. So it's not that one. Naloxone is used as an antidote for opioid overdose. Glucagon is used uh, as an antidote for beta blocker overdose. And by process of elimination, we get to flumazenil, which is definitely used as a benzodiazepine antagonist. So the answer, of course, would be A. Next question. A 32-year-old woman with history of panic disorder is brought to the emergency clinic by her husband after he found her heavily sedated and minimally responsive upon his arrival home from work. The husband informs the physician that his wife had become increasingly depressed over the past few weeks since the death of her mother. He states that her psychiatrist had recently increased her doses of alprazolam and sutrolene due to increasing panic attacks along with worsening depression. Temperature is 96, blood pressure is 105, pulse is 65, respiratory rate is 12. She's heavily sedated and only able to utter a few phrases with slurred speech. She did state that she took a diazepam and several extra alprazolam due to panic attacks. During the physical exam, respiratory rate drops to 8 breaths per minute. Which of the following meds would be the most appropriate to administer at this time? Well, it's a great question. She's definitely uh, got some um, uh, symptoms that are very consistent with benzodiazepine overdose, most likely overdosed on alprazolam. And now you need to uh, reverse this. And, of course, the drug of choice is a benzodiazepine receptor antagonist, which, of course, is flumazenil.